Why, hello there, everyone. I'm Laxo, aka the Kumo Sensei. Minasan, ohayo gozaimasu. Kyo wa donuts u tachi deshita ka. And although I can only speak basic Japanese, today's topic is not about language. Today, we're focusing on breeding some tarantulas. And this today is the Carabin of Versicolor, also known as the Antilles Pink Toe Tarantula. And yes, this is my third female that we're pairing of my six females. So stay tuned for future videos of this species, because we have more ladies to go through. <laughs> A lot of ladies for this one little fella here. So if you just want to see the actual pairing up when the male actually inserts into the female, skip to this time period right here. But without further ado, allow me to elaborate. So this tarantula pairing that you're seeing in this video today is essentially around 9 to maybe 10 minutes long. But this video here is edited down to about 5 to 6 minutes. So if you want to see the full unedited version, please go support me on Patreon because that's where I post the full unedited versions of these videos. So if you just want to see the raw footage, then I suggest go supporting me on Patreon to go check it out. So if you want to support this channel, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe because I upload every single Friday here on the channel. So any support is appreciated. So during this tarantula pairing, this male is just pretty much just signaling in this spot right here for a while. As you can see, he's drumming his pedipalps, which this is to signal the female that, hey, I'm not a male, I'm just trying to, you know, find some love. And he's going to be here for a little bit, so don't mind me. This is just a male being cautious because you don't want your males being eaten by females. But uh, don't worry, guys. This male comes out alive. He doesn't get eaten. So uh, spoiler alert. Now, after this female, this male will have some more females to go after this one. So this one here is my third female that I have, but I still have three more to go after this one. Now, I don't actually pair my males back to back, you know, because I like to give my males some time to actually rest, recuperate, and build a new sperm web. So that way he can be gun loaded and ready to go for the next female. So everything you're seeing now is pretty much the building blocks of me building myself up to a foundation to where one day... I can actually build a, an arachnid tarantula breeding facility. That is my ultimate life goal. <laughs> I've stated this so many times, but this is just a building block. So we're getting there, everybody. Don't give up on your dreams. And if you love something, go for it. Give it all you got. And there he goes, everybody. He's getting closer and closer. And in just a little bit, he's going to be meeting the female. And right here, here he goes. Now he's on the work. Okay, guys. As you can see, he's doing a great job holding up the female, making sure that her fangs don't snaggle him and eat him. And he's going to be inserting for a little bit here. And for those who are worried about him getting eaten, I told you guys earlier, this guy comes out alive. So it's a good thing he survives. Like most of my males. I don't know why people get their males eaten on YouTube. Because as an experienced tarantula breeder, that typically doesn't really happen too often. Yes, it does happen even to the most experienced breeders like me, but very rarely. I say once in a blue moon. So this male here is going to be inserting to the female for a little bit, so we still have a little bit more to go. So after this pairing, I'm going to be treating the female pretty much normally for the next couple to few weeks. Then I'll start acclimating and adjusting to what is needed. Then we can start treating this female special until she drops an x -nac. And I don't want to explain the conditioning because that's... <laughs> Man, breeding conditionings is kind of, it's simple, but it's kind of confusing to people because it's very subjective. So I have my own way of doing it. So jumping back a little bit, I will be breeding another Caribbean of Versicolor female next week. So stay tuned for next week's video. I upload every single Friday here on this YouTube channel. So please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe and stay updated to when I upload here on this channel every single Friday. So in terms of the tarantula breeding projects that I got going on this year, I think I will work on the Harpac Tierra Poker piece once they grow out, that is. They're almost breedable size because their spermatheca is almost sclerotarized. So once it's fully developed, I will try to find a male and hopefully get a tarantula pairing out of those females. Now I do have, I think, nine females left that I kept behind as holdbacks for future breeders. So in the future, I will be looking for a male Harpac Tira poker piece, also known as the Golden Blue Leg Baboon Tarantula. So that's going to be an interesting project to work on. So that project may happen either later this year or early next year. We kind of have to wait and see. And now the male is done breeding with the female. And as you can see, he's trying to break away and slowly back away from the female so he doesn't get eaten. 
And as you can see, I have my tongs getting ready to divide them in case she decides to attack them. But she lets them go pretty easily. And pretty much there is no tension at all. So <laughs> he gets away as a lucky boy. And this pretty much wraps up this breeding video. So without further ado, everyone, I'm Laxo, aka the Kumo Sensei. I upload every single Friday here on this YouTube channel. So please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe and stay updated to whenever I upload here on the channel on Fridays. And also, if you want to support me and see the unedited versions of these videos, please go support me on Patreon because that's where I post the content. And also follow me on my Instagram because that's where I post tarantula pictures and updates at times. And with that, stay lax and laxo out from the Kumo Sensei.